You see this deltoid pump? This is the consequence of the workout that you guys are just about to do. For reference, I'm personally using a pair of 20 pound dumbbells. Let's get into this thing. Good luck. All right, so we're gonna kick this off here by beginning with a shoulder wheel. We're gonna start with the first exercise being some front raises. I'm gonna begin this with the neutral grip just so I can focus on the front head of my deltoid here. 10 repetitions, ready, and go. And what we're focusing on here is not swing that weight. I'm consciously deciding to lift this by squeezing the front head of my deltoid here. So we're gonna be getting 10 reps, and then directly after with no reps, we're gonna be getting into 10 reps of lateral raises here. Four more. Three, two, bringing those arms to parallel to the ground. One more, and good. Directly into 10 lateral raises. Four more. Last one, and good. Now we're gonna be getting into a bent over position, trying to post your head over a deltoid. So we're on about a 45 degree angle, back is nice and straight, 10 repetitions, doing a lateral raise here again. Ready? And go. Five more. Four, three, two, last one, and good. Shaking that out a bit, we're gonna rest, and then we're gonna go through that one, one more total time, then we got two compound movements. This is just really great for isolating the deltoids and really pre-exhausting them before we get into the compound movements here. Shaking it out, and we're gonna begin in just a few seconds here. Again, 10 repetitions. We're starting with the front raise. Bringing those arms to parallel. Ready? And go. Three, two, last one, and good. Whew. And we got 10 lateral raises. Ready, and go. Last one, and good. Ooh, dang, this is pretty good. Now we're gonna be getting into the bent over position, to the posterior deltoid. Ready, and go. Portion. Last one, and good. Ooh. Your deltoids will be nice and pumped by this point here. Whew. Next, we're gonna be getting into the clean and press. Whew. Resting a bit, let those delts recover. We got some volume on the next one. Whew. Whew. Catching your breath, keeping yourself moving here. You can toss your hands on your hips, and this will help you to expand your rib cage so you can get deeper breaths, or you can bring your arms up above your head here too, that'll do the exact same thing. All right, so we're gonna be getting dumbbell clean and press. You're gonna start with the dumbbells down in front of your legs. You're gonna pop it up to do the clean, make sure you get enough room to do the press, and then instantaneously into the press. So it'll be smooth and continuous, so it'll look as such. And that'll be one. We got 15 total here. Ready? Let's get this thing. And I like to keep those dumbbells apart at the top there. Because I notice when you bring them in towards the center of your head, it involves a lot of the triceps and takes a lot of the roll out from the deltoid. Eight reps, halfway. Nine. Ten. Five more. Four. Three. Two more. Last one. And good. Dumbbells down, resting it out a bit. We got one more of those. Whew. Whew. Catching the breath again here. If you need to, go ahead and grab water. Whew. 
Okay, last set of 15, let's get this thing. Ready? And go. You want to prevent yourself from getting that torso swing there. You want to keep that torso nice and straight and have this entirely be a deltoid exercise. Six, seven, eight, halfway. Five more. Four, three, two, last one, uh, and good. Ooh. Rest in it, shake those delts out. These things are on fire right about now. Hanging in there, we only got one more exercise left. Jeez. Oh. So what we're gonna be getting here is just overhead press. So you're gonna keep the dumbbells at ear level, pressing upwards and pressing upwards. You don't have to bring them down to the upper legs or the hips level this time. It's just gonna be all presses. All right, let's get this one. We're gonna get 15 repetitions here. Grabbing the dumbbells, bringing them up to your level, 15 repetitions, ready, and go. Focusing on keeping that core nice and tight, and you never wanna have your hips leaning forward like this. It's gonna put a lot of stress and it's gonna cause compression in your discs of your spine. Keep yourself nice and neutral, core tight. Eight, five more, four, three, Two more, last one, and good. Whew. Resting it up here, we got one more set. Whew. Let those arms shake, you kind of shake out the muscle a little bit there. Might find that that will actually help. Whew. Jeez, these things are sore. All right, last set. 15 repetitions. Push in here. Dumbbells up to ear level. Ready and go. Keep that core nice and tight. Always breathing. Prevent those dumbbells from coming in at the top there. Six, seven, eight, about halfway. Nine, ten, five more. Four, three, two, last one, and good. Here you guys go. You've completed. A very quick, but super efficient and super gruesome home dumbbell deltoid workout. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, then be sure to give your boy a like down below, and also be sure to subscribe for weekly workout tips and nutrition tips that you will not want to miss. Thank you so much for joining me, you guys. See you in the next video.